Hello, I'm Ryan Denora. I am the uh, illustrator of the graphic novel series Restless for the Dead. Um, Restless for the Dead is a graphic novel that is written in the uh, traditional Eastern form of graphic novels, which is read from right to left. And um, this series I have been uh, creating with my partner, Adam Miller, who is the author of the series. And we've been working on it for over two years and have been through many uh, plot and character changes, of course. And it is a story of a, um, a young boy named Aaron who has the power to control the wind and needs to save the world. Now, as the illustrator, it is my job to come up with not only the character designs, but also the panel and page layout, which is something that is unique to comic book art. And here is a picture of um, the majority of the cast. Um, so when we start off, usually we start from the sketchbook designing characters and coming up with plot ideas. And when you design a character, you need to take into account all of their personality changes as well as their facial expressions and also what they look, at, look like from all different angles. Because when you draw graphic novel art, it's all about showing the reader uh, movement and the story through pictures. So every single drawing needs to show that these characters have movement and are alive in some way. So after the characters are designed and the basic plot is worked out, a script is written, and after that, uh, a basic storyboard is made where we lay out the pages and decide what is going to go on each page as well as the paneling effects. And it's important to take into account uh, how the panels lay out because smaller panels are usually read faster, so they intend a uh, faster motion, while larger panels have more impact on the reader. And then there's also uh, different shapes of panels, like squares and diagonals, as well as different uh, speech bubble shapes where a circular bubble may imply uh, words that are spoken, while a more jagged bubble would be words that are yelled. And after the storyboard is written, we, write, we draw the final copy onto the manuscript paper, which we import from Japan. And after it is drawn in pencil and then reviewed, it is then inked over, I, I ink it over myself, and afterwards of the pencil markings, the original pencil markings are erased. And when uh, the pages are drawn, the words are not drawn and ne neither is any of the shading. So it's all basic outlines and of uh, the speech bubbles and the panels. After which I import them into uh, Photoshop. And from there I clean each page, uh, sh shade them, and add in the word sound effects and speech dialogue. And the file copy looks something like this. And uh, it's a long process of line work and shading and figuring out the perfect dialogue and uh, sound effects to use on each page. Um, I'm inspired by many different artists, such as um, the uh, creator of One Piece and Dragon Ball, and the also um, the American creator of uh, Scott Pilgrim, Brian Lee O'Malley. So this is uh, Rest for the Dead, and I hope you'll tune in for the next chapter release. Uh, I'm Ryan Denora. Thank you very much.